Cool, so let's get into the foundations. So, what I'm going to do is um, sort of go back to the plan and then we have a look at this foundation plan here. So, I'll just zoom in here. So, it's got all these sort of different elements and they're sort of roughly all about the same. Sort of, there's three different types, I think. So, there's the five inch sort of walls and then there's the four inch walls and then there's the uh, blocks. So if I zoom out, look at the whole plan again, so you can sort of see roughly that these things sort of line up, and it, you get a really clear sense of what's happening in the elevations, right? So there are these sort of solid elements, and then there's, you can get underneath the house in these certain ways. So, and then the section as well. So the, these will be the blocks, and then the walls here, and then maybe these are walls as well. So what I will do is actually misuse that wall tool and make them the foundations. So first of all make sure you're on the foundation layer, not the floor layer, right? So we're like below it. So and then what I'll do is I'll go wall and I'll make a new wall type. And so what we want to do is probably get rid of that, get rid of that, and then actually maybe there's one that we can go off uh, exterior concrete. There you go, that's looking pretty hard out. CRP concrete, cool. So I'll get rid of all the extra stuff that nobody needs. And then I wonder if I can put five inches in here. Cool. Yeah, 127, sweet. And then what I'll do is I'll save that and I'll call it um, foundation and then um, go 5 inch and then the state like that cool so I'll go OK and then now we can you can draw those walls just like how you know how to draw walls from drawing walls <laughs> Uh, cool, so yeah, and so you've got all these measurements to go off um, and things like that, so you can draw those 5 inch walls around there just like how you would normally How's it? there's a little bit in the corner so I'll just come down here and then go to there and then go up to about there and because, you know, we can always just change it later on, we can just sort of be a bit rough with it. And then, so this one goes from that corner all the way down under a wee bit. So it goes from, if I zoom in, to from there, down to there, and then, would say it goes to about there. Yep, so just keep building that up, and then you know, how you, you make another wall style to get the 4 inch ones, so we'll just go off that one, but we'll call it uh, 4 inch and then probably the same thing for the, um, the blocking as well make sure you save it after you change the wall style and so there's some funny 4 inch ones here oh, if I zoom out And there's all these measurements to go off as well. So 6 and 16. So that's where you can um, put some dimensions in. So you can go from here down. Um, was it 6 feet? And then. Oh, 6 feet 10 inches, sorry. Yeah, that's about right. So I think what I can do is just use a select tool and then you can go up here to the length. You can change it. So 6 feet 10 inches. 
Oh, you can also just double click on that. Cool. And then we can go back to that wall tool. And make sure we're on the right style. Oh, it's a wee bit higher than that. That's all good. We'll just rough it out. How deep is it as well? Doesn't really say. Doesn't really say there, does it? That's quite funny. This is this one. Five inches thick. Hmm, interesting. So we can probably just make that up. Oh, it'll be where the porch is. Yes, yeah, this porch here. So that's three feet six inches. Cool. Oh, and that's in the wrong place too. So we'll go off. This dimension, right? And then... What's this going to be? 6 feet 10 inches. And then... Another one. 4, what was it? 3. Uh, 3 feet 6 inches. Sure, we'll just leave it like that. Right, three feet six inches. And there's another four for that wall. Cool. So we go back to it and then go back to wall tool. Which we want the four inch one. Um, and make sure we're going the right way. And then how long was it? Oh, whoops. <sighs> how long was that wall? Six feet. I think what I can do is just select that one piece and delete it, right? Cool. Because that door's in the wrong place, because I put it in the wrong place. But so that's how you should do it properly. Put those dimensions in and make sure you're going off the right place. And then... You can probably get rid of that now, but yeah. So then you just fill in all the rest of it. And the next thing we need to do to prepare for the, the sheet and the views that we're going to sort of output because we need to make sure that all the um, walls and all the foundations and everything have thickness to them right because right now these are the foundations and they're not going that thick it's all these so I'll show you that next